welcome to this lecture in this lecture we are going to work on content our lectures which is the most important part in our project so for this you can download link is given in the video description this file so open here content dot php and also open update content dot php so simply copy and paste the code from the file make sure the file copy from start to here about the update and paste it here in the below code for updation you can copy the code and paste it here so a little bit different from our previous videos so, uh, for some of you this is new concept like CK editor CK editor is uh, one of the uh, best uh, text processing editor so you can add text uh, the, the key idea is like word if you want to add images videos and like I want to uh, publish a lecture which contains images videos tables headings so we cannot create the form like uh, that the uh, form with the text fields so I cannot uh, insert uh, so for this CK editor is very important so the alignment here are the alignment here is the printing options so also there are the number of options in CK editor so if I want to insert uh, images videos tables CK editor do for you the basic idea is that instead of storing the uh, text in database we are going to store the full uh, text with HTML like uh, look at here if you look at here uh, you can see that the text is here uh, here is the content and you can see that with the uh, paragraph tag and with the uh, attributes and all is here so you simply tag your videos your YouTube videos your content here uh, like I added this one so YouTube video is tagged here so you can just simply uh, I want here. if you want to learn about more CK editor so you can watch this video from our channel so you can watch this video uh, the complete course uh, of five videos how uh, what is CK editor and how it is work but the basic idea is CK editor creates a um, script code like here uh, source code and uh, you can store directly into database and display HTML code uh, in the uh, in your web page so if just I want to share this video on my lecture so go to the embed option and you can simply copy the code and go to the CK editor and here uh, C sharp first lecture the course name is uh, here C sharp project Hindi tutorial for beginners so you can C sharp first lecture line center and the font size you can select any font and size like this 
you can also give the heading or the color so here are some styles that you want to allow and after this you can insert any table so the table is inserted according to your problem you can add any content like column name name uh, or the lecture T sharp you can insert the value that you want according to your problem uh, my basic purpose is how we can use CK editor and after this simply go to source code and uh, uh, after table you can add iframe simply copy from here from YouTube and you can add it into the uh, source code and click it click here go to source code and then click here and iframe is added YouTube video is added so you can increase the size by clicking here and the size is increased or decrease the size so and after that you can write text here is the text and submit click on submit button and the lecture is added so how CK Reader is work very simply uh, just uh, CK Reader folder is here uh, you can uh, view this folder in go to EP and simply there is no difficulty the code is very simple of the CK Reader the procedure is if you look at CK Editor and uh, look at the bottom script CK Editor and CK Editor dot js so include this file CK Editor dot js into your uh, content dot php over the, uh, where that you want to uh, display the CK Editor so CK Editor dot js and here uh, tag and after that simply in text area here use the class CK editor and CK editor is from here so you can use the class CK editor so CK editor class is mentioned in if if I cut this one and I, I want to refresh this page this is simply a text area so if I add class in it the magic and it is converted so basically the CK editor is a full editor and it has full functionality so you can mention you can add your uh, it into your project or you can uh, embed online but prefer is this uh, you can uh, add the folder into your uh, project and then use it uh, simply so after that you can get the value of uh, text area by using editor simply the text area here look at the editor uh, post editor and simply you can get the values from editor like this way also in case of updation the CK editor will display the code but look at the code in uh, the uh, source code here here is the source code so look at the source code CK editor will convert this source code into the output and which is HTML code so you can use this amazing feature into your uh, website so if I talk about content and uh, the table we are going to use only one foreign key uh, which is uh, course ID course ID this lecture is from which course so for this we are going to use 
course ID. So course ID is here. This lecture is from course where ID is equal to 1 and this lecture is from course ID 2. So we can use uh, this one. Here is the lecture name, content of the lecture uh, and the ID, lecture ID is here. So the completely according to our uh, previous code uh, there is no uh, new code or new uh, technique so you can watch this code and watch all previous videos if you are new so thank you so much for watching this video see you in next lecture please subscribe our channel